Hey guys, it's Bree. Um, I know that today was supposed to be episode 7 of What's On Our Mind and stuff, but John's not here, and I just saw something that really tore my heart to pieces. It's 12.30 in the morning on September 22nd, and I should probably be sleeping. I mean, I don't even make up on everything, but I was reading a story about this kid named Jamie Rodermeyer, a 14-year-old who committed suicide because of gay bashing. Like, are you serious? He even asked for help, and nobody wanted to do anything? Well, I, I don't understand why people can't accept the fact that gay isn't a form of... It, it doesn't make a person an alien, it just means that their sexual preferences are different than what yours or mine may be. It's the same thing bashing them is like bashing blacks or whites or, you know, kids with disabilities or whatever, you know what I mean? It, it's fucking ridiculous, and... I have a gay best friend. I've known this kid my whole life. I don't know the, what the, he goes through, but I know a lot of stuff that people go through because of their sexual preferences, and it, it disgusts me. And especially when the fact when this kid asked for help and he never got it? I cannot... The, he took his life because of the the bullying that he got for being gay. He was 14 years old. He had yet to live. You know, it... He hadn't even... It barely hit puberty. It's... It's so ridiculous. People make fun of him, but there's so many other gay people in, on this planet that it, it's... I respect them, you know what I mean? It. They're human. They're not some animal. They're not some savage beast. It's not like they're gonna hurt you. I, I just find it absolutely fucking ridiculous what, what people say and do because someone likes someone of their own gender. It's fucking love. You can't help who you love or what you like. It's not like it just happened that way. It's not like you just look at somebody and like, hey, yeah. No. I mean, yes, I'm straight. But I went through a phase where I thought I liked girls. And through that phase, people picked on me. My best friend looked me dead in the face and called me a fucking dyke. Like, are you serious? I mean, well, I wasn't completely gay. I was bisexual, but she didn't want to be near me. She was kind of weary about me staying the night at her house. It's like, if you think about it, just because they're gay... If it was a boy and you're a boy and you don't like that kid, it's not like he's going to come up to you and want to make out with you and blah, 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 blah. He's not going to want to, like, stick his tongue down your throat just because you're another guy. They don't find every man or woman attractive. They, I don't get why people find it so hard to fucking accept what gay people want. I just... And the politically correct term is homosexual because gay means happy. But if you want to be preferred to be called a gay or a lesbian, that is your preference. But I'm not going to insult you. I'm not going to judge you. And I accept what you guys want. I like Jeffree Star. I support him. He might not be gay. He might just be a transgender, but whatever, I suppose. Chris Crocker. You know, there's a lot of famous gay people. And I might get some comments going, yeah, Justin Bieber's gay, blah, 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 blah. I don't, I'm not a big fan of Justin Bieber. And in my mind, I'm probably going, yeah, <laughs> what a fag. No. I am so hurt by the fact that this kid had to go to that extent. Like, where was the mother? Where was the father? Where was the family? Where were the administrators? Where were his friends? You know, it, it's so... It's so hard to understand why people just can't get it through their heads. So, I just wanted to, you know, point that out, and I apologize for looking at shit today, but I saw that, and I had to say something, because it's getting way out of hand. You know, I just, I find it ridiculous. So, um, just let me know what you think, because I had to get that off my chest. I love you.